All right, my young individuals. Okay, I know some of you guys saw my reaction to this Resident Evil 2 remake trailer. And I got so fucking hyped. But now the hype is down. Everything's back to normal. Now we got to talk about this. They show two trailers and they show some gameplay of it. And we got to talk about the things that I am enjoying and make the little things I am concerned about. And no, the concern about is not something major. Calm the fuck down. It's not like, oh, the gameplay looks bad. No, no, no. It's not, no, no, it's not like that. It's just how they modeled the characters. And let's talk about that. Because that's the minor detail that I have on this so far. So, the biggest change of a character we saw was Claire Redfield. And to be honest, to be honest, I do not like how she looks in this game, to be honest. I really wish they stuck with the Dark Side Chronicles model and how she looked in that game. I think I think I would prefer that model. And also I think she's sexier in that model. But anyways, I think I would prefer that model more. But I'm not gonna say that Claire Refrey looks horrible. No, I'm not gonna say that, but I'm just saying that I'd rather prefer that model than this model but that's the little thing i have um leon uh, uh, okay his face does look different but he looks like a younger version of the vendetta version of leon kennedy so i could give that a pass sherry looks okay too um mr x looks okay too so they all look fine they all look fine just claire was the big one that they changed drastically and share we collect a pass because we never really saw an HD remaster other than also the Dark Side Chronicles. But to come think about it, she does look the same from Dark Side Chronicles and then from the Resident Evil 2 remake. So I'm not gonna complain about a lot of it. So everything basically the character models they look okay. Just Claire was my least favorite uh, remake. All right. So to get that out of the way, let's talk about everything that I pretty much enjoyed about this game. Pretty much the entire game itself looks fucking fantastic. I love how they redesigned RPD, but it still was the same. They did. They moved a couple things around, but they it, it was pretty much the exact same how it looked back then Resident Evil 2. So I pretty much enjoy that. And this is is a remake, but it's a diff, it's a new game at the same time. You're going to basically you're going to remember everything from the original PS1 title, but it's going to add some new aspect. They did the same thing with the Resident Evil 1 remake where they added some new things and they changed a lot of the voices. Thank God, because Resident Evil 1's voice acting was kind of horrible. So they did they did change a bunch of things, but if you still have memory. You still get nostalgia of the, previous, of the original title. So that is a good thing. I am glad they are doing that because even though it's a remake, even though it's a remaster, whatever the hell you want to call it, you still want to play a brand new game. And it works perfectly perfectly and i'm glad they are doing that too they actually made it uh they actually made it uh more interesting than i thought it was gonna be because honestly i thought it was gonna just be a full-on remake just follow the same steps and everything step one step two but no they are altering it so i think it's great that they're doing that also i do want to talk about is the the shooting mechanics and everything so i know a lot of people wanted to fix camera angles and to be honest I did not want that back. Don't get it twisted. I was still a play that still would have bought it. I still would have done it if they did keep their fixed camera angles. To be honest though, I rather had the over the shoulder aspect. And this isn't exactly over the shoulder, but it's basically it's over the shoulder at the same time. And I I love what they do. I love this camera angle. I love I love the camera angle they use. Like personally, like everyone who knows me knows that my favorite Resident Evil is Resident Evil 4. So I do love the aspects of what they did with that game. So I am enjoying this camera angle. I'm glad they kept the over shoulder aspect of it. I'm glad they kept it in this new engine. I think it works great and I really love it. So don't get it twisted. And I know some of you guys think that I hate the fixed camera angle. I do not hate the camera angle. I just rather prefer this specific camera angle. Um last i do want to talk about is the hud basically the ui of the entire game and everybody has mentioned this before and i kind of agree with them too this does kind of look like the resident evil 7 ui and i'm not complaining of that no because the, the resident evil 7 ui was basically the classic ui that we used to have before resident evil 4 which had like the section and had multiple sections you use and i'm glad they kept that i'm glad it's uh, i'm glad they're keeping that it looks great it looks excellent and i'm glad to fucking play this game and just relive basically the Resident Evil 2 thing but in a whole new version of it so it's great I really enjoyed this but anyways I'm done talking about this tell me in the comments down below do you guys are you guys hyped 
for this Resident Evil 2 remake. Are you guys, what do you hate about it? What do you love about it? Tell me in the comments down below if you guys want me to talk about more Resident Evil 2 content until January because that's when the game gets released. Tell me in the comments down below and also subscribe for more Resident Evil content and other content coming ahead. Hope you guys enjoyed. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe. I am out.